Hey guys, what's going on? Rooster here bringing you another commentary today, and today I got a gameplay for you guys with the MPL on the map Summit. You know, one of my favorite submachine guns to use. I absolutely love this gun, and uh, of course, guys, I have some more Modern Warfare 3 info for you guys. I told you guys I'd, I would be making three videos on Modern Warfare 3 information, and this is video number three. You know, but before I start in on the Modern Warfare information, I just want to apologize to you guys for a bunch of things. Now, uh, the first things, first comes first, guys. I am so sorry for not being able to upload a commentary last Friday. Um, I know I did upload one last Friday, but, you know, I didn't feel like it was good enough uh, to keep up on my channel. So I wanted to, you know, take it down and actually redo it. Um, you know, I have a new laptop, uh, you know, new microphone. Uh, my desktop stopped working for some reason. So uh, I'm just, you know, I don't know what to do right now. And I've had so much, you know, trouble trying to upload this commentary. Uh, it's just been ridiculous. So I'm really trying my hardest, guys, to, uh, you know, try and do my best. And I really just want to apologize for you guys. Thank you for, uh, you know, sticking it out with me. I really appreciate it, guys. Uh, you know, can, I cannot ask for anything else. And uh, thank you very much. And, uh, you know, my second apology is if my voice sounds a little raspy, um, it's because I went to a concert last night and I actually went to go see Blink-182, which it was absolutely amazing. Like, I am still pumped up about this concert today. And, you know, it's only like 12 hours after the fact. Um, you know, it, it was just such an amazing concert. And, uh, you know, obviously I was singing along, you know, jamming out. And, uh, you know, I kind of lost my voice a little bit. Uh, but you know what, guys? You guys are some of the best subs I've ever, you know, seen. You guys are awesome. Uh, I love you guys for watching my videos. It's It's been awesome. So I thought you guys deserve more. And, uh, you know, even though I do have a little bit of a recipe voice, I wanted to get up a commentary for you guys today. And uh, I wanted you guys to be able to watch it and, uh, you know, see gameplay from me. And, uh, you know, that's what I'm going to try to do for you guys. And uh, so let's start in on the Modern Warfare 3 information. And, uh, you know, we're playing on Summit today, which is a medium to small size map. Um, you know, I don't know really what it is. And look at this, guys. Three piece, get back up. Oh my god, look at him go. Four piece, oh my god. Woo! Whoop whoop, got him. I mean, I am just losing my voice, guys, right now. Um, but yeah, that was awesome. Four piece, oh my god, for my dogs. That was just absolutely insane. And oh, look at that pistol cow. Um, but yeah, so you know. I don't know. Modern Warfare 3 information, guys, they're going to put a lot more smaller maps into the game. You know, you're not going to get maps like Wasteland or State or any of these big maps where you have to run around for like five minutes, you know, just to find an enemy. Um, they're going to put more maps like Summit in there or, uh, you know, Nuketown or Shipment. The maps in general are going to be smaller, which is going to create a faster, you know, style of gameplay, which is going to be awesome. You know, I can't wait for that. Um, it's going to be so good. Uh, you know, it's just going to be really nice to see some smaller maps. You know, I really don't want to have to run around and, uh, you know, for five minutes, even with Marathon Pro, and, uh, you know, try to find somebody. I'd rather have smaller maps, you know, getting a lot more high action gunfights. And, uh, you know, it's just something that I enjoy more, you know, than trying to run around and try to find other people. Now, I know I brought to you guys in my latest video, or my last video, I should say, um, you know, that there is going to be quick scoping in Modern Warfare 3. And Robert Bowling was asked, you know, are you going to make some dedicated sniper lobbies? And uh, his answer to that question from the interview that I saw was that it's all going to be up to the player. So this is going to be really cool to see. I have no idea what they're going to do. I have some ideas. Um, really, my ideas are that they're going to make it a separate playlist. Um, they're going to have a special game type where you can download it into private matches and have game types like that. You know, or they're just going to, you know, or you're just going to have to make, you know, private matches. Or we're just going to have to vote and, uh, you know, the community's vote will determine whether or not they're going to have, you know, um, you know, sniper lobbies in the game, which will actually be really cool because I'm pretty sure the community would definitely vote yes for that. So, uh, you know, I couldn't wait for that. And uh, last thing I wanted to bring you guys was that air support is going to be returning to its role as just strictly support, um, you know. You guys might be wondering what this means, but if you guys remember back to Call of Duty, the UAV, the airstrike, and the helicopter were just there for support. They were not necessarily overpowered, you know, they wouldn't go for 30 kills a game, you know, even like 20 kills a game, you know, your helicopter would probably get 10 kills, you know, on average if it was doing really well, and, uh, you know, that's something I liked a lot more, and how successful was Call of Duty, guys? Uh, I mean, Call of Duty 4, it was probably the best game ever made, uh, at least in my personal opinion, um, you know, I absolutely love that game, so the fact that they're going back for air support just being support is actually really cool and uh, you know they have attack dogs 
chopper gunner, and a gunship in Black Ops. And in Modern Warfare 2, they had the chopper gunner, you know, tactical nuke, which just ended the game completely, and uh, some AC-130. And uh, you guys can tell how powerful these kill streaks are. Um, you know, so just for that fact, uh, if air support is going to be air support, you know, it's going to really make gun on gun fights that much better. And uh, the game is going to be a lot more fast paced, you know, high action gun on gun. It's just going to, you know, rely on the player and his gun. You know, that's really what this game comes down to. And uh, I'm so excited for it. And, uh, you know, Modern Warfare 3 is just going to be awesome, guys. And uh, look at this final kill cam. Almost pulled off the double kill. So close. But thank you guys for watching so much. You know, I really appreciate you guys sticking with me. And, uh, you know, I just can't thank you guys enough. Um, on Wednesday, there's going to be a video uploaded about Modern Warfare 3 guns. So stay tuned for that. And if you guys did like my video, make sure you click the like button. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please make sure to subscribe. Thank you guys for watching so much. Really appreciate it. And peace.